And now, your Seattle real estate market update with Aaron Janis. Well, hello there. Happy 2024, and thank you for joining us on this first market update of the year. Before we jump into January statistics, stay tuned at the end of this video. We have some exciting announcements. We mentioned last month that we're going to be introducing you to more of the Janus Group team members. There's quite a few of us now. So if you don't already know, the Janus Group does more than just sell real estate. We'll leave you with that little teaser for now. Diane, why don't you give us a look at median home prices throughout Such the area? Such a tease. All right, everyone, starting with a look at the median home prices. Here in Seattle, the median home price landed at $765,000, which is 3.07% uh, less than a year ago. Over on the east side, the median home price was at $1,251,000, which is 13.54% more than a year ago. Zooming out and looking across King County, we see that the median home price was at $775,000, which is up 5.44% from one year ago. Aaron, what does inventory look like these days? Thanks, Diane. Here in Seattle, we see active inventory down eight and a quarter percent with pending sales up 5.53% from last year. There's currently 1.96 months worth of inventory in Seattle. Over on the east side of Lake Washington, active inventory was also down a hefty 35.34% with pending sales up 14% from a year ago. The east side is currently sitting at a pretty tight 1.4 1.14 months worth of inventory. Now looking all across King County, active inventory is down 25.94% from last year, with pending sales also down 2.49%. We currently have 1.42 months worth of inventory in King County. And uh, for now, for the news everybody's dying to know, interest rates, Diane, I know we were heading in the right direction before. Where are we now? We were applauding last month that downward uh, direction and we can continue to celebrate. I think we're moving in the right direction as of January 4th. The 30-year fixed rate average landed at 6.62% and rates have plateaued close to that range over the last couple of weeks of December. And as we enter into the year, here's what Freddie Mac's chief economist had to say about 2024. Between late October and mid-December, the 30-year fixed rate mortgage plummeted more than a percentage point. However, since then, rates have moved sideways as the market digests incoming economic data. Given the expectation of rate cuts this year from the Federal Reserve, as well as receding inflationary pressures, we expect mortgage rates will continue to drift downward as the year unfolds. While lower mortgage rates are welcome news, potential home buyers are still dealing with the dual challenges of low inventory and high home prices that continue to rise. We've talked about this many times yes. before. You've heard us say it time and time again as we've coached those sitting on the sidelines waiting for rates to drop. Lower inventory plus lower rates equals increased sales prices. Now it's only January, but the spring market really starts now. So reach out to us and let's come up with a strategy so that you can stay ahead of this market and be prepared for when your dream home pops up, which as you know, could happen at any moment. So shifting gears a little bit, uh, beginning this month, we're gonna be adding a new segment to our market update that takes a quick look at some key property management uh, metrics as well. Now this month, we'll begin by looking at average rental rates in Seattle and Bellevue for single family homes of all sizes. So that number is currently sitting at $3,750 is the average rent. It's about $100 more than it was a year ago. Now, if you look at this graph, this will show you that in King County, our vacancy rate sits at just under 3.8%, while average days on market are 27. So what do you think, Diane? Do you like our new PM segment? It's very exciting and a perfect segue into all the good, exciting news we have to share now. Um, so yes, enough with the teasing. As Aaron just shared with you, the rental rates, uh, we not only do here at the Janus Group, uh, we sell real estate, we help sellers sell, we help buyers buy, and we also have a property management group. So for the last decade, we have managed rental properties throughout the Seattle area, which is exactly why we've entered into this wonderful segment to share with you guys every month. And this just in, we are also excited to introduce uh, JG Design Solution. That's right, folks. If you have plans to purchase, sell, or invest in real estate, our design solution team offers renovation services of all sizes for our clients. And we've been doing this for a while now, but now it's official. So if you want to know how you can benefit in partnering with our team to achieve your house goals, reach out to us today. And if that wasn't enough motivation for you to subscribe to any of our social media channels, or channels, I don't know what is. So keep tuning in this year as we're going to be providing even more educational videos for buyers, sellers, and investors, new listings as always, and we will be posting stunning before and after shots from our design team's work. So hit that subscribe button. We're on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and if you wanna go down a YouTube rabbit hole, all of our videos are posted in one spot right there. So thank you again for joining us, and we'll see you next time. House Goals Realized. Janus Group at Remax Integrity.